Hello everybody. Sorry about this. This is Nisane and at the moment I'm not feeling good at all. I was actually going to do some videos and have a little fun, but I kind of got down and out. My body went another direction. And if you're looking at my eyes, I am I have to take a pain pill. You don't know it's, it's really, really hard with sickle cell. It really is. I am not asking for your pity or anything like that. If you notice, half of them makeup is off of my lip gloss is off of my <sighs> my eyeshadow is still there. But, um, uh, I was trying to, you know, give you guys a video of my ranting, and this is my rant, my rant and rave. Um, just, just tired. My body says different when my mind says we're gonna do this, we're gonna do that. And my body says, I don't know who in the hell you talking to, but we're not doing anything. As you know, a lot of people can come on here and they look at my videos, they don't say anything. And it doesn't matter, really. It's self-medication and meditation to me. Um, but... It's really, really, really hard. When you're 41, and basically a lot of people have told you when you were younger, oh, you know, you, you're not going to make it, this, that, and the other. You can't have kids, and I have four. I have four beautiful children. They get on my damn nerves, but they're mine. They tell you, well, you know, most people don't make it past a certain age. I'm 41. I've been sickly all my life, and nobody could tell. Because I'm a good, I could put on a whole mask and be like, I don't want anybody to know about me. Shield myself away from people. That's what I've done. And sickle cell is... A really 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 bad blood disease and it hurts it messes up your life and sometimes people if you're in a relationship it can burden them it really really can it can they are there and they help you and it's it's like really crazy I've had people in my life that couldn't stay in my life because they couldn't deal with it I've also ran away people in my life because I didn't want them to be a burden you know I didn't want to be a burden on them um, because whenever the outcome comes I, I didn't want anybody you know around but you know I have a husband I can't run him off, you know, I tried, but he sticks with me, he really sticks with me, you know, he works, he goes to school, and he takes care of me, and I'm proud of him, I really am, and I have to say to you women or you men that have somebody that is with you, that is sticking by you cherish them because sometimes sometimes you you won't get that in a lot of people you know your family's there for you you know sometimes you need somebody more you know to make you you know feel like you're not a burden to anybody you know your family will say that but then it's some things they do. 
My family loves me, don't get me wrong, they do. I stay away from them. It's my choice. Um, I keep them updated, but it's my choice. I may not update them on everything, but I update them. Um, sometimes I don't tell everything that's going on with me because maybe I don't want to worry anybody else just like I don't want to worry myself because a lot of doctors tell you even with lupus don't stress don't do this don't do that you know and stress is the number one killer in a lot of people and with you know the disease that I have yeah you know it's it's really hard if you must know it's it's really really hard I thank God for everything that's why I can still smile you know I'm really trying right now but to tell you the truth guys I am not myself right now I want to cry but that hurts too you guys if you really know a person or have gone through this you know what I'm talking about so I just wanted you guys to know that you know even though I don't have a little famous videos and stuff like that I am going to start doing you know like some TV shows I've gotten into the newsroom and I think I'm gonna I believe I'm gonna start talking about the newsroom and True Blood because for some reason I've gotten addicted into suits you know I, I don't do all that other drama stuff but suits Talking about law, I'm good at that. Um, <laughs> um, what else? True Blood, Vampires, um, and the Newsroom. Newsroom is basically based off of, really, NBC, ABC, and USA. Any of them that has it, all of them. It's, it's, oh my God, it's a great show. But when I get better... Um, I'm going to see how this goes tonight. When I get better, I will. The Newsroom and the True Blood, the other series, that come on tomorrow. I have really gotten into them. Really. I just want to give you my opinions about them. That's it. Maybe I'll be good at it. Maybe I won't. Who knows? Anyway. Guys, I thank you very much for listening to me. I am going to sign out. <laughs> Miss Tanae did that in a while, the way she normally does it. So I'm going to say au revoir, adios, konnichiwa. God bless you, God keep you. I'll see you angels again later. Bye.